I should be cautious around here. Hey. Up the hill. Ha! Mine now. my own filth in here.
Get me to a safe place. Then we will talk. Thank you. It was very unpleasant in there. You have killed them all. Bastards. They deserve to die. I was going to kill all of them. That damn cage was too hard to get out of, is all. Oh, Apollodorus sent me to help you. Give me the scroll. Scroll? I do not have any scroll. Your job was to carry it. I hid it on our ship. I did not want it to fall into the wrong hands. Where is this ship? At the bottom of the lake. They sank it. Ah, very well. I will get it. Apollodorus is waiting for you at the lighthouse. I will tell him to find you near the sunken ship. Precious scroll. Neck. The gods love a generous soul. Abin! Bitch! Here's your precious papyrus. Well done, Bayek. I see you are a capable man. Someone I may be able to trust. The scroll was meant for the Roman general, Pompey, in an effort to sway Rome to Cleopatra's side. She will be grateful to you for keeping the communication secret. She is at my estate. We're headed there now. How does Aya fit into all this? Her cousin Phanos informed me that she was a driven woman stalking deadly prey. It so happened that I also had reason to bring down this prey. When Aya was successful, I stepped in to protect her. We are grateful. And we are grateful that you have eliminated Eudorus. He was an odious individual. I should tell you that in addition to Eudorus, I put an end to the Philakatai of Alexandria, Gennadios. Gennadios? I'm very glad he is dead. But it will cause serious problems for you. The Philakis are a tightly bound group. And murderers. They will certainly come after you. So be it. Can I ask why you wanted Eudorus dead? As you know, Cleopatra's brother, Ptolemy, is too young and pliable to be a strong leader. We believe Eudorus was the force behind Ptolemy, responsible for so many of Egypt's current ills. Here we are. The villa is up ahead. more at the village. Oh. The queen enjoys the life of high society. I'm pleased that Aya is bringing some sober substance to Cleopatra's social circle. 
She is an extraordinary woman, your wife. I know. Bayek, before I can disclose all secrets, Cleopatra must meet and approve of you. She can be particular. Let me give you some advice. When you approach the Queen, bend your knee in deference. Speak only in reply. Yours is not to question, but to answer. Do not be distracted by the festivities. She has a large entourage, and they like to amuse themselves. Sometimes to excess. Speak clearly, in measured tones, and above all, do not meet her gaze. Ready? I cannot wait. <laughs> Catch me! Catch me! Come here, both of you! Yes! She I'm caught sure me with her husband. The sensation is most delightful. This way. Oh, don't worry. She doesn't huh? hold the crowd. Bees! Where is my opium pipe? I will sleep with anyone as long as they agree to be executed in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> like Xanthivis. He was well satisfied with his bargain. Who is this toothsome fellow? In Mehoto Ek My queen, this is... Uh... Well? It is a generous offer. But I've already pledged my life. To this woman. Aya, you have chosen well. Come, we have much to discuss. Celebrate, my friends! <laughs> you were meant to kneel. <laughs> ah, Pasheremta. Meet Aya and Bayek. They put an early end to Eudoros. Delightful. You are joining our efforts, then? We do not know what your efforts are. Eudorus was a member of the Order of Ancients. They are responsible for my exile. They tore me from my throne. And why should I care about them? Well, the snake has many heads. Those heads make up the Order. The snake is the man who killed my son. It is not so simple. What are they talking about? I don't know. They must know something. The Order of Ancients seeks to control all Egypt. Ptolemy is but their puppet. We have informants in each region. But they have been unable to touch the Order. <clears throat> Across Egypt, mysterious forces work against us. For instance, here, in the Nile Delta, the endless sands swallow up whole villages. Yet, a malignant human force moves with them. That force is one of the Order of Ancients, called the Scarab. And over here, in most sacred Giza? A shadowy figure called the Hyena controls all that occurs. What is certain is that Giza is the land of death and loss. And then there's Memphis. All is cast in my land. Even the sacred Apis bull himself. The one called the Lizard has worked a sort of diabolical power. So the snake is the Order of Ancients? Yes. Eudorus was known as the Hippo. You are right, my love. He was not the last one. All of these are. When the Order wants something, as in Siwa, it does not hesitate to crush all in its path. For Siwa, now Fayum. It is the most oppressed region in all of Egypt. Where the crocodile wields cruel power, the denizens live in constant fear. That is the fate that awaits all Egypt if we fail to stop the order. We need decisive action. It is time for assassinations. We still have not found the man who killed Remu. 
Our sun shed will weep with joy when we clear the map of those figures. You are my Magi now. Protector of the true Pharaoh of Egypt. So it shall be. Tonight, we drink, celebrate, make love. Tomorrow. Oh, 
I should not be seen in this area. Where is that damn girl? You, Neb, are young, and your legs are strong. Perfect for my needs. A pigeon arrived not long ago. I sent Ruya to fetch it, but she is so unreliable. Probably batting her eyes at the Master of Arms. If I see her... Never mind her. I want my letter. Run up to the pigeon tower and fetch it. All news is important to us these days. All right, Stuart. I will see what I can do. are in a ruckus. What has upset them? An ill omen. How did that charcoal get spilled? A lot of blood. Where's the body? Still fresh. The railing broke, and someone went over it. Such a mess. Sight here. Shut up! Shut 
Bye for now. Mm, guards here are vigilant.
still fresh. Where's the body? Someone went over it. Take you back to Peleus for the proper rites. Poor Ruia. If you had only known how to make such a leap. What did you get yourself into? Beasts with the faces of men prey on the weak and powerless. We cannot simply show our bellies to the jackals that plague our land. By the gods! Ruya! What happened? She was thrown to her death from the Pigeon Tower. Your letter. Why was she killed? That is the badge worn by Dimnos, our master of arms. Why did she have it? I will find out soon enough. May you walk in the field of dream. Dimnos, I'm looking for Ruya. Why would I know where that peasant is? Perhaps because she has your badge. Shit. Well... She was just an Egyptian dog. No matter. Why did you do it? Truth? I didn't mean to kill her. Only teach her a lesson for her insolence. She refused to read a letter for me. You must confess to Peleus. I suppose you want the same fate as Ruya. You stupid Egyptian. I'll teach you the same lesson she learned. Come! Try! You will pay, corpse!
Himnos? Yes. He killed Ruia out of base cruelty. And he died because he thought I was also less than a person. What a senseless tragedy. She was a smart girl with a good heart. 